Good morning, friends, and welcome to Vlogmas. Uh, let's see, what is today? Today is Saturday. <laughs> you guys will not see this video until Monday because I have a recipe video going out tomorrow. And then today I am currently uploading what I did last night, which was go to the ballet, which was fantastic and was an awesome time and if you missed that go watch that vlogmas because it was a lot of fun um so today uh is saturday like i said i've already been up um i just pulled my hair in a ponytail got my sunglasses on my head because i've already been up i've already ran to the piggly wiggly which is less than a mile from my house and um i had to pick up a couple things uh john is coming for dinner tonight and uh, at five o'clock and so I didn't have any meat thawed, so I just grabbed some meat. I'm just gonna make a quick lasagna. I'm gonna make some uh, uh, garlic knots and some with marinara and a salad. So, and if I have time, I may throw in some brownies or something like that. I just made a lasagna up for tonight's dinner really fast, really easy. And I decided not to make the second one with the quinoa and brown rice pasta because I had whole wheat uh, lasagna noodles, which is fine. So I just made one big one. And uh, what I'm gonna do is I'll probably pop this in the oven about four o'clock, really, really covered well with uh, foil and on a cookie sheet. I always do it on a cookie sheet because sometimes it'll bubble over a little bit, especially if you make a big one like this. Um, and then it's probably going to take about an hour because I don't pre-cook my pasta noodles. I just let them get done in the oven. And I just make sure that I have enough sauce on it that it, you know, they don't dry out. And that they'll taste really, really good. So, um, the last 15 minutes it's got to cook. I'll probably top with this here mozzarella and let it get all nice and brown and bubbly on the top. And now I need to make some dough up because I'm going to make some garlic knots to serve with this. Uh, some brownie batter. This is from scratch. This is my recipe for rich brownies from scratch. I added some walnuts to them and now I'm going to put them in this pan and I'm going to bake those up and I'm going to clean up the kitchen and sweep and mop and hopefully these will come out delicious and perfect because this smells fantastic. These are ready to go into the oven and I will link my lasagna and my brownie recipe down below if you all are interested in checking that out. Okay, so now I have to clean up this mess, <laughs> obviously. Um, I have this tray, this plate that I got from Ikea out for my brownies. I've got some Christmas mugs in case anybody wants coffee. I have to get rid of all this stuff in here and do something with it. Brownies are still in the oven. They have 22 seconds left. I have iced tea getting ready to boil and I have my dough made for my garlic knots. And yeah, I need to finish cleaning the kitchen because it's atrocious. And then I gotta hit, take all the garbages out and I've gotta hit the living room, the hallway and the bathroom and I should be good. Are all done and I had a little sneaky taste and they are delicious and I have a container you probably seen it I'm probably gonna make more but I have this I'm just gonna put it out tonight if anybody wants it the uh, the Christmas white Christmas trail mix and I will leave the uh, recipes will be down below but look at these brownies yum 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 and I got all the living room all cleaned and straightened out the bathroom scrubbed and uh, why in the world am I getting all foggy? I have no idea. <laughs> um, so anyways, I got iced tea made and the last thing I'm going to do is run the vacuum cleaner and do a quick mop through and I will be ready for company. Oh, lasagna. Did I say the lasagna was in the oven? Lasagna's in the oven. Garlic knots done. Uh, I've become a little obsessive compulsive on making them straight, but it's supposed to look like a Christmas tree can you see here okay so all I do is, is cut mozzarella sticks and I put it in my homemade pizza dough in little balls and I just make the tree shape and then I'm just gonna cover this with um, my towel and this is gonna rise for a little bit and then I'm gonna brush it with 
some Italian seasoning and some, I have no idea what that is, a little thing that won't come up. It's a little string where they're brand new, so. <laughs> Anyways, I'm just gonna leave this here and those will rise and puff up and then um, I'm gonna brush it with some Italian seasoning and some garlic and uh, some olive oil and butter and then we're gonna bake that once the lasagna gets done. Yum. Good morning. It is Sunday and uh, I look really tired today. <laughs> so forgive that. But uh, I am getting ready to go to church this morning. The kids at church, the little kids are doing a play uh, called Happy Birthday Jesus. And I didn't want to miss. So I got a, um, a friend of mine and a neighbor. We go to the same church. So they're going to, I'm going to go with them because everybody else last night worked um, pretty much all night. And so, uh, they're asleep. I had to get up really early this morning to make sure that Lucas got up because he has to work. Um, he's doing a special brunch with Santa or something like that at work. And so he had to set all that up and be there really, really early. So I am dressed and I'm just kind of, I've got my coffee down here and I'm just kind of trying to relax a little bit uh, this morning and get woke up. <laughs> but um, I don't know how much I'm going to film at church or if I can. Um, but I think it'll be nice to go and see a Christmas play at church. It's kind of like it would seem really odd if I didn't go to church around Christmas. I just think it's really strange. Um, I don't even know. I realized that church or Christmas Eve falls on Sunday, so I don't know if they'll have church on Christmas Eve. Some churches do, some churches cancel because a lot of people go out of town and that kind of thing. When I was growing up, we had candlelight services at our church when I was younger, and um, if it fell on Christmas Eve, we still had it, and um, I miss those. It's like it was tradition, and I just like feel like it's part of the season. I don't know. What do you guys do? Do you guys go to church for Christmas? Let me know in the comments down below. By the way, I've decided to combine Saturday's footage with Sunday's footage, and I'm going to put it all together later on today, and then I will, um, that will go out on Monday, which is tomorrow. So, uh, and today you're watching a recipe video, uh, for Sunday for Vlogmas. So, yeah, so um, anyways, I thought I would combine the two, and uh, that way I know that it was long enough and everything. I'm not sure exactly what I uh, got totally filmed yesterday. Um, I got really busy after my family got here, and I'm not sure even what footage I even got. <laughs> but um, yeah, so I'm trying to wake up this morning, and uh, we're going to head off to church here soon. Getting super super busy this evening I realized right away that I have not even released today's video it's already uploaded it's already ready to go I just never have released it <laughs> or made it public um, so I need to go do that um, so anyhow I just thought that I would end this vlog I'm not sure what I filmed today but I just got super busy it's like I realized that Christmas is a like a week away and I had all this last minute 
purchases I need to buy. I need to think about my groceries just to make sure that I have all the little, uh, you know, little things that we enjoy during the holidays. You know, sometimes I pick up extra candy canes, extra coffee, um, just making sure that I have my bases covered as far as those kinds of things because we have extra company that comes, uh, extra family, and uh, that kind of thing. You know what I'm talking about. I mean, you start thinking about these things <laughs> right at the end of time and when the stores are the most craziest, but it's just kind of what happens happens um, as far as my meals are concerned I'm covered as far as that is but I just need to um, just cover my bases and just make sure that I have yeast for my bread and just double check everything because when it gets Christmas Eve and Christmas a there's nothing in the stores and B a lot of places are closed so you're you can forget it you're not gonna get in anywhere <laughs> so um, so I think I did get all my last minute purchases as far as gifts are concerned. I did have to buy a couple grocery items because I decided I wanted to make some things that I wasn't anticipating on making. So this week I have a lot of, um, I just need to uh, tidy up my house. I need to do finish my gift wrapping because that was the, la the stuff that I bought today. Um, and uh, I have baking to do this week. So um, let's see what I want to make. I want to make snowball cookies, sugar cookies, peanut butter fudge, um, peanut butter cookies with the candy kiss in the middle, which I call peanut butter kisses. Uh, let's see what else. Was there anything else? Oh, yes. I want to make pumpkin rolls and my cheese ball for... Uh, Christmas Eve and Christmas so Christmas Day I'm going to be making a turkey I don't know if I even said anything to you guys or not but I went to Target and they had butterball turkeys for 99 cents a pound and I bought like a 23 pound turkey <laughs> it's big and so I decided that's gonna be for Christmas so we're gonna do that probably gonna do mashed potatoes and gravy green beans I'm just gonna keep it really simple um, just traditional almost like Thanksgiving really um, but just you know straightforward no cranberry sauce or anything like that just straightforward turkey and um, probably will make dressing and stuff like that to go with it so it'll be delicious um, Christmas Eve have not totally 100% decided on what I want to do for Christmas Eve, so we'll see. But I think that we're going to have some nibbly bits, and I need to double check all of my groceries and all of that for that. So, that is pretty much it. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed spending uh, some of my Saturday and my Sunday uh, with me. I uh, had a lovely day today of just shopping, church. I went out to eat with friends today. It was just a really nice day. I hope you guys enjoyed watching. If you have not subscribed to my channel, please do so. And give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy these types of videos. And I'll be talking to you all again soon. Bye, guys.